Hello? Hello, everyone. Thank you for coming to Tech Lightning Talk. I'm Hyunshin Yang from South Korea. I'm working in the IISTRC. Today, I would like to talk about the brief introduction and Techers project and future works. Uh, this is my contents. So, at first, I will introduce about the Techers project briefly, and then I also uh, present about the Techco integration with other projects for Techco industry. So, what is the Tecker? Tecker is an open stack based NFE orchestration framework. So this is the, the NFE reference architecture which is based on the Edge. So among the, these components, Tecker uh, corresponds to the VNAP manager and NFE orchestrator. And Tecco is uh, compatible with the Edge NFE environment. This is the tech architectures. It consists of NFE part, VNFM part, and NFE catalog. Uh, basically, TechCore supports two kinds of the beam. The first one is OpenStack. Uh, uh, the other one is Kubernetes. And then this beam is managed by the infra driver in the Tecker. And the NFVO include the function of the multi-site, the function of the beam and network services, and the VNF forwarding graph. And then VNF VNFM include the management driver and the monitoring driver and the management of the VNF instance. And TechCore support uh, many kinds of the catalog descriptor, such as the network service descriptor and the VNF forwarding descriptor and the VNF descriptors. And Tecker also supports the horizon so you can control the NFE, the features through the horizon. Uh, this is a basic Tecker workflow. So basically, Tecker uses uh, templates. So the, when the administrator wants to create a VNF or the network services, just for the template to the Tecker. And Tecker for that information, the hit translator, and hit translator, it translated from YAM based template to the hit aha uh, template. And then the hit translator for that information to the hit, the hit recast the resources that need to generate the VNF. After creation of the VNF, the Tecker can manage the VNF using the monitoring driver and the management driver. If STN controller needs, Tecker also uh, request to the STN controller to set up the data paths between the VNF. And then the Tecker support several uh, descriptor, one of the descriptor is a VNF forwarding descriptor. So if user use the VNF forwarding descriptor, user can make the VNF forwarding graph like this figure. And the tech also supports the network service descriptor. So the one of the big difference between the VNF forwarding descriptor and the network service descriptor is the how many VNF forwarding descriptor, uh, forwarding graph it have. So that service descriptor can define the many VNF forwarding graph in the one template. Uh, one of the, the uh, as, as a perspective of the telco industry, one of the important issues the fault management. So telco also support fault management. So basically, TechCore supports the basic monitoring tool, uh, such as ping, HTTP ping, and the monitoring, just monitoring driver. 
So it could be used for the health checking of the VNF. And the tech also supports a detailed monitoring tool. Uh, the the alarm-based monitoring driver is, uh, which is based on the AODH and the accelerometer, so it can <coughs> it can use it can use for checking the resources which used by the VNF. And the other monitoring tool is Jabbix-based monitoring tool. It could be used for the application level monitoring. And uh, from now on, I just uh, more detail, detail feature in the Tekker. So one of the, one of the feature is the Jabbix plugin. So this plugin is proposed to support the op monitoring of the applications in the VNF. So uh, with this driver, we can check the status of the applications. And uh, another, uh, another feature is the Kubernetes Beam. Uh, before this feature, uh, OpenStack only support the OpenStack Infra as a beam in the Tekker. But this feature supports the Kubernetes Beam, so you can deploy the Kubernetes uh, containerized VNF to the Kubernetes using the Tekker. And Based on the Kubernetes beam, we also support the containerized VNF. So to support the containerized VNF, Teco uh, make, make a translator between the Tosca and the Kubernetes. So Teco translate that information from Tosca to the Kubernetes and forward to the Kubernetes. And Kubernetes deployed the containerized VNF according to the VNF descriptor. So this is the sample VNF descriptor. So you can define the containerized container information in here. And we also, uh, in the Tekker, Tekker support the two kinds of the VNF. One is the VM-based VNF, other is containerized VNF. So between them, to communicate each other, Networking integration is required. So to do that, we also make a, a integrated networking solution using the Korea Kubernetes. So with this feature, we also support the SFC for the hybrid VNF. So you can create the service function chaining with containerized VNF and the VM-based VNF. And uh, this is the latest feature, this, uh, the resource reservations. The resource reservation also one of the big issue in the telco infra. So uh, we made a, this, this feature for supporting the resource reservation. So this feature work with the Blazor project. So uh, when you want to resolve the, the resources for the specific VNF, you can define that information, and then the attacker follow that, and then deploy the VNF with the reservation policies. So you can deploy VNF with resource reservation policies. Uh, from now on, actually, we are working on Tekker, making more features in the Tekker. So we are so, so one of the, the target is to make it more close to the standardization. So we, now we are so considered the edgy specification and we want to change some part according to the edgy. And then we are so focused on the stability and then um, some many features about hybrid VNF and very kind, many kinds of the beam too. So this is my slide. Thank you for attending. So if you have any question or interested with Tekker, please free join to our IRC channel, Tekker. Thank you.